Okay, guys, hi. Oh, God, it's been a... Jeez. Oh, Hello, Derek from uh, Glasgow here. Quick uh, cancer journey update, I think. That's while I'm sitting here uh, trying to do some practical stuff. Uh, last time I spoke to you, it was in the hospital, uh, just after chemo. So that's a week and a bit ago now. Um, and just to give a quick update of how I've been feeling, uh, which is... In a nutshell, terrible. <laughs> Chemo is not good. Um, I'm going to stay in my t-shirt here. Uh, so yeah, I was in the Beatson Hospital in Glasgow last Monday. Can't remember what date that is. But yeah, I had my intravenous strip for chemo. Then uh, subsequently, I've had radiotherapy every day, uh, Monday to Friday, for that as well. I'll just pause the wash machine because that's annoying me in the background. So yeah, chemotherapy, uh, cisplatin chemotherapy to also help with my cancer treatment. Uh, and I had radiotherapy every day after that as well. So that first initial week, just to give anybody a breakdown uh, of what it's like. Chemotherapy is lots of side effects. You've got like nausea, stomach cramps, shivers, sweating, uh, metal mouth through the radiotherapy as well, loss of appetite. So... I think I got pretty much all of those. Um, I was feeling pretty ill um, for initially Monday right through, right, right through to that first week at the weekend actually. So yeah, that slowly kind of wore off a little bit. Then the radiotherapy was still daily last week up until today. So I think the main challenges from my experience for the past two weeks is just try and keep your energy levels right in terms of consuming the right foods. Um, I haven't been able to taste uh, anything whatsoever really uh, until the past couple of days. Um, I did eat some junky foods because um, my mind was taking over my belly a little bit. I had a little burrito and I had some curry sauce and chips which I couldn't really taste but upset my stomach the following day so um, yeah, try and eat healthy, try and get out for a walk, try and get some fresh air. You all have your really low days, um, especially the, the way you're kind of ill feeling after the chemotherapy and the radiotherapy, which is obviously in my head because I've got um, cancer within the head and neck, uh, which is very sensitive areas. So just yeah, a quick update today. I'm feeling a bit better today. Um, and this is like, uh, what day is this? This is Wednesday, so this is seven, eight, nine, ten, ten days after the chemo. I've got another two chemo sessions uh, to get within this seven week um, radiotherapy sequence that I'm on, a program that I'm on. So that is on the 26th of October 2022 when I get my second um, intravenous strip and overnight for the chemo. Uh, which I'm not looking forward to, but hopefully I'm a little bit better prepared this time in terms of what to expect, what the side effects are. Everybody's going to be different if I go through chemotherapy in terms of what side effects they do get, uh, how you react to your body. But uh, the way you need to keep looking at it is these things are trying to help me and cure me of cancer, hopefully at the end of the day. So... Um, just a quick video, apologies, I've been looking a little bit untidy. Um, I'm just sitting at the kitchen table, I'm getting my finances in order, I've got some practical stuff to do today, so I'm in the mood. Quick video, just let you know that um, thanks again, my YouTube channel is being hit all over the world actually from my last video, so I really appreciate everybody even just watching my YouTube channel for Chasing the Phase. Um, it's my clothing brand, but it's also got a, a well-being, a huge well-being element to it as well in terms of chasing the phase, everybody's phases in life, and just keep chasing it. Don't give up uh, is the, the motto of my my clothing brand. It's also got a lot of kind of music and DJ connotations there as well, uh, where it's came from. Uh, but anyway, that's on a different note, just to check in really, and a quick video that I'm feeling a wee bit better today. After my chemo 10 days ago, and uh, yeah, I'm preparing well now for, for the next dose of chemotherapy in a week or so. So, yeah, just keep my energy levels up now for the next another 7 to 10 days, and uh, I'll take it from there and give you all an update again after that. So, 
Thanks. I appreciate all the love that I'm getting via social media and YouTube. And obviously my close friends and family that have given me overwhelming support in terms of getting to and from the hospital. Uh, uh, Favours for taxis and things like that. So yeah, really appreciate it. You know who you are. And uh, thanks very much. See you later. Bye.